so every time we've gone to Disney, we've always stayed at a affiliate Disney hotel and a Disney hotel itself. And we've always stayed at the Campanile or the Explorer hotels, but this time we wanted to try out something different, something new, because we wanted to test out another hotel so we can give you guys a little review on how it is. And this time, we stayed at the Grand Magic Hotel, formerly known as the Magic Circus Hotel, but it's now changed to the Grand Magic Hotel. And honestly, it was one of the best experiences we've had at an affiliate hotel. We went during the Christmas season, which honestly, it was one of the best decisions to make. Everything was decorated for Christmas. The whole lobby, the whole area smelled great. It felt great. The staff was really friendly. It literally felt like you almost walked into a Disney hotel, even though it's just an affiliate hotel, not an actual Disney hotel but it felt that magical when you walked in. So after checking in and getting our keys, we decided to go check out the rooms. We were kind of skeptical a little bit, even though everything looked great. The rooms tend to be sometimes kind of a mess a little bit, but this time, this room did not disappoint. It was spacious, it was big. It had bunk beds that the boys were fighting over to see who got the top, who got the bottom. They had a huge bed for us parents there. It was well thought out for a family of four. And honestly, for the price that we paid, it was well worth the price. It had a really cool light in the middle that was actually shaped of a moon and it had a picture of a moon and the boys had fun playing with that because you can dim or you can make it bright. So it was really fun. It was really clean. It was really warm. It was really spacious. Honestly, one of the best places that we stayed at when visiting Disney parents. And like I said, we've stayed at other affiliate hotels before, but this one has got to be one of the best ones. And then we went to breakfast the next day. Honestly, we really didn't record there because breakfast is typical in every other hotel that you go to. But we wanted to check out the lobby. The lobby area, the lounge area was amazing. It was decorated to the top, all festive, all Christmas-like. My boys really enjoyed it. You can see their expression on their faces. They really enjoyed the fact how everything was decorated for Christmas. And the lobby slash lounge slash bar area was the highlight of the hotel, was the highlight of the trip. Whoever designed this, whoever made this amazing, amazing talent, amazing job. The LED lights on the columns, the LED lights on the panels there, it makes it look really great and also it changes throughout the day. If it's bright out, the LEDs change and it makes it bright. If it's night out, it actually dims out and those screens you see there, they actually change throughout the day to different backgrounds. And when the background changes, music comes on, everything kind of goes dark and it starts doing this transitioning thing where it makes it look really, really magical that you really have to be there in person person to enjoy it and to actually witness this firsthand because it is truly truly a remarkable work of art that's all i can put it into this lobby area has got to be one of the best ones we've stayed at in different hotels that we've visited throughout our travels and it's a family friendly environment even though you see a lot of adults even though it's a bar area you still see a lot of families a lot of kids enjoying whatever they bought at disney parents talking about their next day going to disney and literally it is a family friendly environment and totally worth it also, it's not that far from Disneyland Paris itself. It's only a 10 minute ride on the buses that they provide, which takes you to and from the parks. And I do recommend that if you're going in the morning, wait a little bit because they do tend to get a little bit packed. And if you're coming back from the fireworks at night, also a little bit longer because they also get really, really, really packed. But honestly, you guys, this has got to be one of the best experiences we had when going to Disneyland Paris and staying at an affiliate hotel. Honestly, if you're looking for an affordable, family-friendly hotel when visiting Disneyland Paris, you should try out the Grand Magic Hotel. It is totally worth it and you will not be disappointed. I hope you found today's video informative, helpful, and enjoyable. And if you did, please hit the subscribe button, follow us on Instagram, and we'll see you next time here at Magic Land Paris. Have a magical day.